Twitter. <clears throat> you know who you are. Thank you. Uh, you've all come to our aid. Hashtag we stop at nothing. Which is winning in the poll, by the way, Matt. Your, your hashtag is winning. Um, Matt's sat over there. It's a glorious... Is it me or at three o'clock is the sun starting to set already? People are letting us know about what's happening. It looks like nothing will run north of York for the rest of the day into tonight. Probably get fixed overnight. Uh, the train has come tangled up with some wires north of York. Uh, LNAR tickets, as we have, are valid on the West Coast Main Line. It looks like we might go over from Doncaster to Stockport anyway, and then try and work our way up through to Edinburgh that way. So all is not lost. Doncaster next. It's fine, Matt, because uh, we've got to get out of Doncaster anyway. And then we go over to Stockport, up through Manchester to Preston, up the West Coast Main Line. Except I just checked. <laughs> Uh, and they've, TransPennine, have cancelled the 1642 <laughs> from Doncaster to Stockport. <laughs> well, that, we're, now, we're now even at two severely delayed trains. Wait, no, hang on. One delayed, three cancelled. But look how pretty the sunset is. <laughs> Lovely. So GWR went wrong. Oh, so. I think it's the fourth major delay we've had. My southeastern went a bit wrong. LNER's gone wrong, and now TPE have gone wrong. <laughs> I mean, at least everyone's being consistent. Consist cons consist there's a consistency. The trouble is, the sun has now set. The sun, it, we were it, it, it is dark. Nice yeah, summer. it should have. We should have been here oh, in, in the daylight. Lovely twilight. It should have been daylight Doncaster, and now it's dark Doncaster. Notice how they're all alliterated beautifully. Doncaster alliterates with both day and dark. Okay, Doncaster. Finally, we come in on platform eight. eight. I think platform zero is down. Or if you look at it. Sideways, the infinite platform. <laughs> infinite. Is like a whole other building or something? Yeah, Vicky and I, when we did the Thorn South to Thorn North, hello Matt and Louise, uh, connection, our train came in on platform zero at Doncaster and it's been built to the side and there's this footbridge and lift for step three across, as Matt has now discovered. It's a little walk, and I believe, ha, it's a pacer. And do you know what this is? This is the greatest distance we've had to walk to get to the zero. <laughs> What's this? This is a, a, a classic pacer train. They're the Marmite of Britain's Railways. You absolutely either love them. Or these trains. Or hate them. This yeah, I call, I refer to these as a bus on rails. Joe, how much do you like Platform Zero at Doncaster? Better than any of this. Can you give us like a zero with your, with your hand? Zero! And wave by. <laughs> Cheers, Joe. See ya. So, what, what do you want to do in Doncaster for an hour? Oh my goodness, <laughs> just drink it in. Shall we talk about, um, what was it, zero? I hear you got some, 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 we got some maths zero to questions. Yeah, yes. let's, let's, do, let's do All some right, maths. hit me with it. This is, the, right. uh, this is the math segment of one of my videos, which, which never happens. You, all your videos should have a math segment of some description. This, come on, this is... Uh, if you don't know who Matt is, uh, and you should do, because you... You're almost at the magic half a million now. Yes. What's that like? Very exciting. What's that oh, like? I can't. I'm, I feel like I'm half a legitimate YouTuber now. I feel like my subscribers might be the the ones oh, to take hey, you over. If you can bump me over half a million, I will be very very pleased. Matt's link is in the description. But I, uh, maybe one in <laughs> fifty of my videos are about trains. Very quickly, I feel like we want to have a bit of mass. But what is your obsession with the constant that is zero? Why is it such a a, a key number? The problem is people don't take zero seriously. Ooh. So I may I maintain. <laughs> no, I maintain zero is a perfectly good number. Yes. And you ignore it at your peril. So. Famously, computer programmers will use zero all the time. Yes. And that's because in a binary system, like all systems actually, you start counting at zero. At zero. And back when systems yeah. had far like fewer resources available, 
there was no reason to waste a perfectly good number of zeros. So if you were counting up in binary, you would use zeros. So you always got the zeroth, like famously the zeroth term in a list. If you're programming, you'd, you'd zero zero index is the fancy. So that, that's where you get the phrase zero indexing yeah, from. Yeah. Accounting system that starts at zero. So you're counting, but because you're no longer the number you're using when you're counting no longer matches how many there have been. You use indexing. So you're still using it to count and keep track of things, but the, the, the number one position is no longer the first position. You've yeah. broken that link. Okay. So today, Cardiff was the zeroth <laughs> station I went to. Yes. And then Red Hill was the first. Yes. Well, it, so, it, yeah. was, it was index one, yeah. which means it was now the second. second. Yeah, so we're not yeah. doing one to eight, we're doing zero to seven. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and really quickly, I want to touch on, I recently did another video, I'll link to it, about uh, TFL's Oasis system. Now you find this fascinating. This is amazing. Because TFL use a four-bit system to, yep. which only allows them to have 16 zones in Oyster and they've now run out from 1 to 15 but we both thought, said it didn't it, it was like well, why don't they use z zero, and use zero and call it zone 16 is that a, is that a viable thing absolutely and I don't they don't have to put like zero in the middle and call that zero they could put 16 on the outside but 16 and zero in an Four bit system yeah. are the same. TFL, watch my videos. Anyone I'll, from I'll, TFL. I'll ask TFL why they don't do that. I would love to know. You've got two <laughs> options either do that or I would love to come in and have a chat. So please, someone get in touch or let me come and visit you. I, I want to know more about the zero. I want to see that too. I want to see that. Right. Uh, from a cold and dark. Platform Zero, as it's great for train spotting, by the way. If you want to watch, well, some, yeah, want, a train just, will go by and you're like, oh, it's, it's one, one, one of those. those. We've, we've had a pacer, we've had a, it's, all, it's all good. Two to go. To stop, two to go. Two to 75 go. 75% complete. Come on. We're going to make it. It's coming up in 20 to 6. The mysterious train to Manchester Air <laughs> uh, is back. Except it was two minutes late. Matt's gone to the toilet. And at seven o'clock, we're arriving a little bit late into. Um, you were calling it Stockton earlier. Not not Stockton. Stockport. I remember the first couple of hours. <laughs> Stockport. And somehow we got to keep the energy and excitement going for the last few hours. Platform Zero is here at Stockport somewhere. tweets earlier sent to both of us saying oh platform zero is always closed and blocked off there's a train to bucks and due there's a zero sign but it's not even like a bay so why is this a zero what was this previously i don't know this is where this is where yeah so when they maybe the old i feel like there's an entrance to stop like on, on both sides that's the old side and this is the yeah. new side so maybe they built a new platform and they built this new entrance and that's why it got a zero. And a beautiful thing has happened at Stockport. <laughs> Matt Parker, you're on a pacer. <sighs> Where we, where, where's the prime seat on the pacer? There I, isn't I, one. <laughs> They're all terrible. Cancelled. Don't be doing no. that. Ow. <laughs> no. Just to kid him. Just, just to kid him. <laughs> this is it, Matt. The last one is coming in. It's going to go via Penrith and Carlisle. I can see our last train arriving. I don't know. I made a thing. You, do, you what? what you, you met with doing a thing. We had some. We had a little snack and a couple of drinks. This is it. This is it. We're five, we're five minutes away. We're literally five minutes away. It's been a long day, man. And we are on platform three. Okay. So. Where is? 
We know the drill. I we got to find two. We got to find, find one, one and, and then, then we got to find zero. There's a man called Lewis. <laughs> You look, hello, hello. you look like a man oh, called Lewis. That's water's drink. Oh my goodness! Look at that. Oh, that's water's drink. Oh, look at that. Hey, we got a banner. You got a banner. Oh my goodness! Some people made it to banner. <laughs> Check it out. How have you made that? Like, oh, well. like. That's all here. Who are you? Yeah, Who are you? Stephen. Hello Stephen, who are you? Hi, Renzo. Hello Renzo, who are you? I'm Scott. We spoke to you on Twitter, hello, and yes. this is Lewis. So there's I'm four Lewis. of you. Yeah. This is Platform Zero at Haymarket. There's even a train on Platform Zero. I don't think it's going anywhere. Scott bought us a gift bag <laughs> with the hashtags written yeah. on. That was the winning hashtag. Let's put it on the shirt. Yeah, sure. Right, the ball there. Thank you. Steve made the banner. And Lewis brought the tea. You're local, Lewis. Tell Lewis, this is genuine. Go for it, yeah. What is Platform Zero used for? What trains come here? Mostly train movements. So the, the, the depot down there is Haymarket Depot. Haymarket and, Depot, yes. And so everything comes into here, and sometimes like a bit of air training. And so have you ever caught a train from or to Platform Zero? Not yet. Is that not yet? yet. <laughs> it's, my, it's my mission to get one at some point. Now that you've completed all, because this is all kind of your fault, now you've completed all eight zeros, in conclusion, I feel very fulfilled. I feel like there's a uh, people don't appreciate zero. There's a lot of unsung zeros out there. Three. And we've managed to <laughs> draw some attention. Have you been saving that all day? Yeah, I have. I have. Uh, yeah. No, I. I it's what, what a sense of achievement because I've just been doing them just randomly over the years, and now I've actually ah, I got them all. I'll give you one final summing up thought because there was room. Well, we know that there's a platform zero being constructed at Leeds right yes, now. A lot of people have pointed this out. And then we got word. So my friend Lee, hello Lee, told us that actually they might do the thing where they increment all the others and. What the change what, all the what the building is? The yeah. Oof. So there may or may not be a new platform zero at Leeds next year. Matt, will you go to Leeds if there's a new yeah. platform zero? There's a tiny chance we'll have to do this all again. <laughs> I'm ready. I'm ready. This was a good practice run. I think we could do. We could do nine. Five, Five four, four, three, two, one. Happy yeah!